we decided to start Castle Biosciences, it was recognizing that there was a, a huge gap between how patients are being treated if you rely solely upon sort of the clinical and pathologic features available by traditional staging of diseases, in this case cancer, and you ignore the potential impact on the biology of a tumor, biology of cancer, which we use by measuring the, the genomic profile of that cancer type. It's interesting, those of us who I think have chosen healthcare as a vocation, you can go into healthcare many different ways. You can become a clinician serving patients one by one basis, or you can go and work for the industrial side of healthcare, maybe working for a pharmaceutical company or a, in Castle's case, a diagnostic testing company where you can impact many patients because your test is available to more than just one patient in front of one doctor. We went into, into healthcare at Castle because that, that it's a passion for us. It's always been about how do you impact patient care the best possible manner. And if you do that right, and you do it right more of the time than less of the time, then the rest of your business follows along behind that. We try to harness the genomic information of the biology of that tumor, that cancer, and provide that on top of what you already have so that a more specific and more precise treatment plan can be developed for an individualized patient that's better or more accurate in terms of addressing outcomes than if you don't use the biology of that tumor. If we focus on what is the current treatment paradigm, where are the limitations, what decisions are being made based upon pathology features, and can we improve those decisions? And improving in the case of our melanoma test might mean actually reducing unnecessary procedures and it might be finding people who have high risk disease despite having low risk pathology and getting them appropriate care. Um, that's the way that we've approached our business, beginning with UV melanoma, moving over to cutaneous melanoma, and more recently with our, with our recently launched pipeline test. What makes Castle a difference overall? Uh, is, there a, is, there a, is there a uniqueness to Castle Biosciences that we should talk about? I, I think we can, we can tackle that in probably three or four items. Uh, first and foremost is keeping patients at the center of our business. If we aren't improving patient care, then we should get out of town. Secondly is the employee group that we've attracted to Castle and kept at Castle. We try and find people that not only enjoy working hard, working hard in terms of, of solving issues facing patients, but also like to work together. They want to contribute working with their colleagues to push harder and better so we can meet our overall core mission. Those are exciting opportunities at Castle, and we do that through people. We do that through innovativeness. We do that by going back to the beginning and saying, is the way patients are treated with a certain condition today optimal? Or do we think harnessing the biology of that disease or that cancer in some cases or other disease disorders in others can be improved if you apply genomic information innovatively to get to a better answer? Um, that's exciting at Castle.